Hey guys, it's me again. I know it's been a while since I made a video, but I've unfortunately been busy with school, which is actually where I am right now. I am finally on campus at Full Sail University, which I'm studying film. For those of you who don't know, um, here in Winter Park, Florida, which is part of Orlando. Um, I actually just got out of class, and I remember that today the Avengers trailer came out, and I've been waiting for this for a long time, so I actually haven't watched it yet and decided it might as well make a quick video. So, uh, here we go. Avengers trailer. Hopefully, uh, hopefully this is, uh, not a Rick roll. <laughs> you were made to be ruled. In the end, it will be every man for himself. Get ready. There was an idea to bring together a group of remarkable people. So when we needed them, they could fight the battles that we never could. <laughs> Gentlemen, what are you prepared to do? No offense, but I don't play well with others. Big man in a suit armor. Take that away. What are you? A uh, genius billionaire playboy philanthropist. If <laughs> 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 we can't protect the earth. Sure, we'll avenge it. <laughs> All right. Dr. Banner, your work is unparalleled, and I'm a huge fan of the way you lose control and turn into an enormous green rage monster. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay. That. That was a good trailer. I'm very happy because there's been a lot of hype about this movie and in my experience hype only occasionally works out um, for the better. That is a very good looking trailer um, and it looks like uh, it looks like Iron Man again is going to steal the show. I mean Robert Downey Jr. is amazing. Um, but that the action actually <laughs> looks really good because I was kind of worried because Thor Thor action was all right. Um, some of the stunts in Captain America looked a little, hey, I'm on a wire. Um, but the explosions were very impressive. In fact, the first time I like stuff started exploding, I was like, Transformers, what? Um, but that looks like an awesome movie. I was a little bit worried that it was gonna have too much going on. Um, but the characters kind of from that, of course, this is coming from a two minute video but the characters look like they will work well together and Scarlet oh Scarlet <sighs> but anyways uh, I can't wait now uh, see I was a little worried about Avengers and the main reason is is I believe it comes out like a month before the Dark Knight Rises and so I kinda figured that after Dark Knight Rises come out people will be like the Avengers what is that uh, but this actually looks like it'll be a pretty impressive movie. Um, so we'll hope that we'll hope that it lives up to th that trailer because I was impressed. Um, and it's good to finally see uh, Nick Fury, Samuel L. Jackson, um, doing something. It looked like he had a bazooka or a rocket launcher or something. I don't know. I don't know guns. All I know is he looked Banff. Everyone looked Banff. Uh, I remember from the photos I was a little bit eh because there were costume changes. Um, Thor doesn't look to have the exact same costume, but then it looks like it changes, because in one shot he's sleeveless, and another he's not, and then they changed the Captain America um, costume from the movie, and I know that the costume in the Avengers 
to me, I mean, it looks closer to the comics, but I don't know. I kind of liked the one that they had in the uh, Captain America movie. I know I didn't post a review for Thor or Captain America, but I really did enjoy those movies a lot. Uh, Thor, basically, I might as well give a short review on it since I'm on that subject. You know, Thor, I thought they did everything in Asgard perfectly. The Earth stuff was really cheesy, but I loved um, the the whole look and feel of Asgard. I love Anthony Hopkins. And you know what? I thought, uh, what's his name? Uh, Hiddleton, I think is, is the guy's name, who played Loki. I actually really, really liked Loki as the villain in Thor. And the main reason behind it is that there were about ten scenes where a traditional comic book uh, villain would, like, turn, like, away from everyone, and then he would give, like, his little evil, like, you know, his evil smile. Pardon that. Uh, but um, he didn't seem to do crap like that. Um, and I genuinely, at, at different points in the film, felt sorry for Loki. So I loved Loki in Thor. Um, and then Captain America was... Uh, I was surprised. I actually really enjoyed Captain America as well because I felt, um, I felt Captain America's struggle, you know, to do good, things like that. Chris Evans did a great job. Uh, I much prefer him as Captain America than the Human Torch. The Fantastic Four movies were just a little bit too cheesy for me. Um, so I thought that that was a much better uh, film than, you know, like a much better superhero for Chris Evans to play. Uh, and and the the work that they did to make him look scrawny was phenomenal. That was some really good uh, special effects work right there. Uh, let's see. Um, so yeah, basically, there's the Avengers trailer. I'll have a link uh, in the description down below uh, to the trailer if you haven't seen it. If you if you click on the link that I provide and it takes you nowhere. Uh, like if the video gets taken down or something, just say in the comments or send me a personal message and I will switch out the link. Um, but uh, let me know what you guys thought of the Avengers trailer. Uh, I'm going to try and start making uh, videos more frequently. Um, my schedule here is a little bit nuts. Um, also, I am about to post uh, videos... Uh, bug. I am about to post some videos on my video log channel, which there will also be another link in the description down below if you guys haven't subscribed to that. I actually, uh, this past Labor Day weekend, went up to Atlanta and stayed with my friend Steven, and we went to Dragon Con uh, along with our girlfriends. So, well, not plural girlfriends, my girlfriend and then his girlfriend. Uh, <laughs> and so uh, I have uh, like two hours of footage from Dragon Con. It's a pretty much a big convention, lots of anime and movie stuff. Um, there's a uh, panel with some popular voice actors, including Kyle A. Bear, who was uh, the voice of Adult Gohan and the narrator from Dragon Ball Z. I actually got to meet him, which was pretty cool. All those will be coming up, I want to say soon, but the problem is, is two hours of editing plus crazy schoolwork is uh, a lot. But uh, those will be on my vlog channel hopefully soon, and if I actually, you know, can afford to go see any movies anytime soon, uh, then I'll be sure to let you guys know what I see. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Like I said, let me know what you thought of the Avengers trailer, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.